G'day everybody, Peter here from The Property Club. I'm here in Diani Beach in Kenya. And I'm gonna head down the beach, check it out. And uh, yeah, let's have a look. Okay, so this afternoon's a bit windy today. In the morning, it's not as blown. Uh, but I have seen something down the beach here, so I'm gonna walk down this way. I was actually gonna go the other way, but the waves are already, you know, it is high tide, so we can't actually go that way. Even there is a bit of water here, but I think if we just walk down this way, we can see all of these kite surfers, and there's literally just heaps of them. Let's see back here. Very cool. Let's get a closer look, eh? There's cool little caves. Awesome. Seaweed's been wrapping around my leg. We're just trying to get a bit further down so we can get a nice shot. Okay, so I've come about as far as I can go. You know, the rocks here, the rock formation is just a bit, you know, heavy on the foot. Yesterday I tried to come down here, but it was really, really blown, so it was very windy, okay? So it's hard to get some shots, and uh, I'm coming back here this morning just to get some more shots, really, to show you what the beach is like. And you can see it's gorgeous, beautiful white sand, soft on your feet. I met an English couple yesterday and they said they've been coming here for 23 years due to the close proximity uh, to Europe and the UK. And they love it. They love the white sand beach. They love Diani. They love the beach. They love the people. And uh, they love the atmosphere and the fact that, you know, they've got so many like beach bars and clubs. I did do a video um, of some of the nightclubs in Diani. Really, really good. I have to be honest, like Philippines is cool. Got some cool girly bars, got clubs, bars, it got everything from Manila, Angeles to Clark. But mate, they don't have anything on this place. I'm telling you. We went to this club this other night and I'll post this video soon, but um, this club was run by Italians and it was just amazing beautiful nightclub beautiful people um, beautiful music a DJ and uh, even musicians like people with live sax etc this is the resort I'm staying at this is called Baobab so this is the resort and there's many many more it's a long long beach it goes for miles and miles
morning. Um, uh, good, thank you. I'm just walking, yeah. yeah so far, so good, yeah. Having a nice day. The water here is really, really interesting. At the moment, this is what it looks like. But later in the day, there's a sandbar just out here and the sandbar will appear. And a lot of this, because this is still relatively high, the water, this will go really, really low and you'll be able to walk out almost to the sandbar, about halfway. And there's this beautiful sandbar there and a reef break for surfers or those wanting to yeah, maybe I just have a body surf or swim. When the high tide was out yesterday, I got to somewhere around here, probably just past this point and down here. And uh, I stepped on some rocks and I, it was really jagged. As you can see, these rocks are, uh, you know, when the water covers the, these rocks, you can't really see it. And it, you know, the water comes all the way up to there and it's not good for walking. So really, you know, you're much better off walking in the morning like I am now. I'm glad I stopped because I got to around here and uh, hurt my foot and I went, mm, can't see anything. Not sure how long these rocks will continue for. I better stop walking and turn back and go the other way. So that's what I did yesterday. <laughs> Pretty funny that I'm looking at this now and I thought, well, man, I probably got to just here and went, hurt my foot. I'm glad I didn't continue. Check this place out. It looks like someone's private palace on the beachfront. I had been looking at property just out of interest sake and online it looks cheap, but when you actually go there physically and talk to people, especially beachfront property, it is quite dear. Okay, and when I'm saying dear, um, look, we saw a resort block and they had it advertised for $600,000. And we went down to check it out. And when we inquired about the price, they said, no, no, this resort block, this beach block is not 600,000, right? It's 6 million. And I'm like, how did you false advertise and drop a zero? So like, the thing is here, there is a lot of opportunity and you can see it, but they will see you coming, mate. So be careful. Yes, so I'm with someone at the moment. Um, he's trying to find a resort and um, I'm actually looking at running it. So that could be the future if we can find something. So it might be here, it might be somewhere else. We're not quite sure yet. Well, let's check this place out. Beach bar and restaurant. Let's get a zoom in on this. That looks nice. So at night there's all these beach bars, you know, places like this and it comes alive. With beach bars, nightclubs, girly bars, you name it, they've got it. Whatever you want, you can get here, trust me. This sand is just so nice, it's white and soft, it's extremely soft on the foot. It feels like clay when you're walking on it. Um, in Australia we get this kind of really fine sand and it makes this sound like this when you walk on it. This does not. It's like walking in clay. I just don't know how to describe it. It's really, really nice. Anyway, it, it's so much nicer than anything we've got in the Philippines. Ooh, it's getting deeper. <laughs> Thank you. 
It's a beautiful day in Kenya. The flamboyant. You know what? I'm going to call it. You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of Boracay, okay? This is the closest thing you can think of to Boracay. However, the sand feels better. It's longer and there's far, far less people. So my preference, Diani, 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 well over Boracay. Nowadays, Boracay, the stretch of sand is like less than half of this and literally it's just full of people and you can hardly move and it's not as exciting as it used to be, let me tell you. This is gorgeous. Literally, this is my favourite house on the whole beach. I love this old Art Deco African design, this beautiful tree to the left and you can see perch in the top of this tree is a beautiful bird. Not sure what type of bird it is, but it is gorgeous. If you were to ask me what my dream would be now, it would be this. This is pretty cool. It's spectacular. I love that old, you know, Art Deco African design, you know, right on the beach, something like this. But no doubt it will cost a few, a few million, <laughs> a few bob, not a few million shillings. I'm talking a few million dollars. OK, so, yeah, it's uh, it's a bit far off. Yeah, Like, I'll be honest, I am kind of working things out for myself personally. What next? Beautiful. What a wonderful tree. And this is the thing here in Africa, you've got beautiful nature and beautiful wildlife, just like this. And look at this home. This is a gorgeous mansion. I love how they build here. They build homes to look like big mansions or castles. And it really does look like some kind of castle. On my way out, I spotted this gem. Look at it. There's a big mansion behind there. And it's got this gorgeous pink color. It's like a pink pastel palace. Awesome. Truly unique. So 1850 for barbecue, live music, and unlimited the same, food. The same yeah. will apply like here. Right. So, for example, if you pay the 1000 for yeah. the bed, it means after having the buffet, yeah. you're going to add 850 Ah, okay, yeah. got it. And, and so you can go swimming, yeah, you can yeah, use you can the day swimming, bed, day everything. Day That's really good for $18. $18. That's yeah. fantastic. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah, I'll be back for sure. So Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Have a lovely day. Thank you.
how's that? $18 unlimited food. You get a day bed. You can swim in the pool. $18. It's <laughs> eighteen dollars Australian. It, it, it's like, mate, that's like eleven or twelve dollars US. I band here. They have music, and for eighteen dollars Australian, about twelve dollars American. Okay, you get all of this: unlimited food, live music, a day bed, and a swim in the pool. That's cheap. What a bloody bargain! Okay, well, this has been Pete from the Property Club. Really appreciate you watching. Thanks so much. Double thumbs up and bye for now. Look at the shape of this home. It's a modern marvel. Headed back in now, but as I was saying earlier today, the water was like to here when I came out just only about one hour ago. Now I'm back and you can see the tide is quickly receding.